SOLIDWORKS CAD Modeling, Lecture 9 Variable Sketches Open a part file On XY plane, enter sketch mode Draw a centered rectangle And place dimension of 300 by 100 Extrude it to 5 mm And now, I'll open sketch on the front plane and draw splines the first spline will be like this and we can draw two splines on the same sketch but I'd rather draw the two splines on separate sketches So these are the two sketches for the splines. And I'll open another sketch for a corner rectangle. And place the dimension for the distance and the thickness of the hole. And I'll make the upper left corner to be coincide with the top spline. And the lower right corner to coincide with the bottom spline. So the upper left corner will be coincide with the upper spline. And the lower right, upper left, will be coincide with the upper spline. And the lower right will coincide with the lower spline. So I it's true cut to a through hole and then generate linear pattern and then I'll choose this dimension so that the variable sketch will be functioning and then I'll make the pattern to be maybe 28 and generate you can see that the upper left corner will be coincide with the upper spline and lower right corner of each uh, is true cut will be coincide with the lower spline and this is uh, how the variable sketch works